Hey everyone, welcome to Yagnama Reviews right here on YouTube. I'm your host, the one and only King Kansas, here to bring you another figure review. And in this case, as you guys can see, it's not a Transformer figure, it is a DC McFarlane multiverse figure. And it's from the new film that's coming out in two weeks that myself and my nephew are going to go see called Black Adam, starring Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Can't even speak, I'm so excited. Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Himself as Black Adam in the lead role. I think it took like 10 years for this damn thing to come out. Anyways, my nephew end up getting the regular version before my cape version comes in. And I go, he goes, King, Uncle King, you want to review my figure? I know I sliced it open and looked at it, but would you want to review it for the guys on your channel? So you know what? What the hell not? So I'm here to bring you guys this figure so I can show you guys. So here we go. So here is Dwayne. The Rock Johnson as Black Adam. I can say it looks like him, if you guys can see that. You know? There's Black Adam logo. You have Black Adam on there. The usual McFarland barcode. Let's check the other side. The cutaway. Let me show you guys the top. Black Adam and the back. Here you go. You get a movie accurate. Dwayne the Johnson on the back. The one I have is comic book like, you know, and he gets special effects, his card, and of course the usual DC multiverse uh, stand. So let's get this sucker open so you guys can see how it looks out of the packaging. So, yeah, my nephew was uh, gracious and kind enough to let me review this for you guys, even though he did open it. Just got to open it carefully because I don't want to damage the, the packaging for him. I'll show you guys the inside. Like, this is what you get, guys. Look. There's this card and there's the stand. I'm not going to open it up on my nephew. He doesn't want to use it as well. But uh, let me just do this quickly. And I'm going to turn it backwards so you guys can see Dwayne the Rock Johnson in the background. While I do this, and this is what it looks like in the clamshell. So you get the figure. Let me see if I can pick this up because... I need a higher stand, but that's the facial. It looks like the rock. I can't wait to show you guys in person. His two lightning bolts and gold. The other one, you guys will see, it's like a metallic silver. So give me a quick second, and I will get the Black Adam out of his clamshell. Like always, guys, I'm going to show you the special effects. So this is what you get. You get his lightning bolt. I don't know if you guys can see that because I know it's uh, kind of tricky with this camera. For some reason, you never get clear. But he shoots him. I'll show him how it attaches later. But that's what you get. It's a harder plastic than the Marvel Legends we get. Okay. And one sec, guys. All right, guys. I just had to adjust the camera. So this is Dwayne The Rock Johnson, a.k.a. Black Adam, and his figure. Check this out, guys. It looks cool. No, I'm not going to do a comparison because my nephew said, why don't you wait till you get your figure uh, later today or something so you can do it? And I go, no, no, no. Let's just do yours. And then, you know what? You guys can easily see all the other videos on YouTube. But this does have gold. It's well detailed. It looks phenomenal. I didn't expect the head sculpt to look like the rock at all. That looks like the rock. That's the people's eyebrow. But the detailing, phenomenal. Look at it. I'm telling you, it looks good. Like, and we got it for like twenty, I guess four twenty-five dollars at Walmart. The one that I ordered cost me about ten bucks more Canadian. But for the most part, it looks good. So let's put them down here. Stands well. Lightning bolts. Oh yeah, I'll shoot the lightning bolt so I can show you guys what it looks like with the special effect. Okay, it just wraps around his hand. So you get something like this, so you guys can see. See? Shoots it off. You can do so many different cool poses. My nephew said he's going to do something like that, but you could see how that ends up on the rock. Or Black Adam in this case. I don't know, this camera. I want you guys to see it. Yeah, it's tough. I don't know, for some reason the camera is acting up. There you go. He has a serious face, though. You could see it. But that's the special effect. 
that's how my nephew said he's going to display his Black Adam. So that's it, guys. That is my review on McFarlane's DC Multiverse Black Adam figure. I hope you guys liked it. Like, share, and subscribe. Check out my other video. Check out the other ones that are going to be coming up later this week and perhaps next weekend in the weeks to come right here on our YouTube channel. So be the hell good. Open these damn things up. Display them. Play with them. Whatever. As long as you keep away from the kings and my shelf, king's all good. And most importantly, stay off my throne and I'll see you guys next week. Take it easy and stay